All right, so we are chasing. It is May 1st. Yeah, yeah, we, the 1st of May. 1st of May, already getting tornadoes? May, not really, not yet. But this thing is really catching my eye down here by Carson City um, in a very highly sheared and high three cape environment. So we're gonna blast Southwest right now and hopefully catch up with this within the next 30-ish minutes because it's flying towards us as well, so uh, yeah. We would gain visual on the storm's base around 5.40 p.m but would soon after realize that the tornado potential was all but diminished because the storm had lifted north of the warm front. There's for sure something. You can see like a right over here. Right down here, right up here too. I'm not really 100% sure yet. It looks like it could be rain or it could be the suspect lowering. But uh, not a chase until we fit a dirt road. All right, you're gonna get our live reaction to this uh, this road up here because I have no idea if it's dirt or if it's paved. If it's paved, we're, we're going, but uh, we're heading this way now, you can see that base pretty well now, actually. But we're gonna blast through these trees and get on that side of it and watch and learn. I guess, I don't know. Okay. It is a dirt road. No, that way is dirt. This is paved, so we're, we're, we're fine. This looks like it's streaming upward. Oh, it is. It's also not being moved. Not in a favorable light, so I don't think it's rotation. There's this one area of like really broad motion right there. No, it's rotating right above us. This turning in the clouds aloft was likely only due to the high wind shear present given the environment that day, meaning this was likely not tornadic rotation and more just turning in the clouds. Hold up. I'm going to hang up for just a second so I can film it. All right. It was just spinning way harder. There was just a random gust of wind, too, that came in. For no reason. What time is it? Someone know? It's 6.02. 6.02. Just looked at mesoanalysis. Given an hour or two. <laughs> boom. <laughs> boom in this area. Big boom. And like, that's really pretty too. Yeah. Yep. And uh, those are the storms that are coming right for us. 100, 100 to 153 cape, I think, plus yeah, like... A good amount of surface vorticity, that might get it done. It's still surging north though, that's why we've got yeah. kind of all this, you can see those clouds too are rapidly moving in. So there's a ton of warm air advection still, but um, yeah, definitely have higher hopes now too. Oh my goodness, look at this freaking hooker. That, look at that down there though. That's definitely something. That's a giant edge of a cloud of some sort. Oh my gosh, did this thing just freaking nudge it? I don't know, but we're seeing one. Crazy rain shafts that look like tornadoes. It's it's somewhere in this mess, right? From either down there, through like up to there. Uh, there's another lowering kind of forming that looks suspect. I don't know. We are waiting for this to come closer. Right now. So yeah, we'll oh, see. Look at radar. Okay, big, big, big wall cloud now. Um, I just got visual of that tail. That's about to produce. That's about to produce. But we gotta get down there fast. It's northern one right in front of us. Then there's this southern one. That southern one looks really low and really intense. Like the last visual I got, there was a giant tail cloud forming. Looked like it could produce. Tails fizzled out a little bit, but you can definitely see it back there. Um, better visual. Uh, wall cloud has either been dissipated, at least that one, or it's completely massed behind the rain. Get past these two houses and just go down there. And then if you can turn around to the south, 
or like to view south, I guess is what I mean. Unless that's it. Yeah, I think that might be the wall cloud actually. Because if you look at radar, it's like a bookend board. It's like literally March 30th. It's like, goes in, then you have the other supercell right here, the line. <laughs> whoa, whoa, I might've gotten that. <laughs> Let's go. Both vortexes, or whatever you want to call them, have been completely devoured. So, and that is the rain. Is that? You're gonna probably see it as soon as we turn. There's just some really scuddy clouds right in there. Oh, whoa. All along there. And then, that, what is that? Holy crap, there's a big base. Yeah. Is there a. Uh, we might have turned. Are we out ahead of the line? Uh, yeah. Dude, this storm is so weird. I don't know what that is. That's a big poop, I think. Well, not the smell. But thank you. <laughs> I can't really see much else. This is the most interesting structure we have. Anything. <laughs> you want to stop here? Or keep going? Let's keep going for a minute. Yeah, we gotta keep going, or else we're gonna get like overtaken. Oh my gosh, though. What is on the road? I can't tell if it's a shelf or if it's just some really, really weird scud. Just so we can kind of analyze. I just want to look real quick and get a photo on my phone. Oh, your bud. Yeah. Okay. Whoa. What in the heck? This is either going to destroy my camera or be a really cool shot. Yeah. I, Dad, I would not. Because this is like literally racing and this is going to... I think it's literally right there. Here, I'm... It's the shelf. Like, door, door what? Oh. That's extremely low. Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell right now, not going to lie. Okay, I think it's this next road up here. That's a lot of rain. Yeah, we're about to like pound it. Yeah, this is becoming. <laughs> Whoa! Watch out! <laughs> Hello. Hello. I'm surprised they didn't even go special weather statement on this guy. I mean. Yeah, I mean, there's definitely hitting the criteria for it. Uh -huh. Uh-oh. All right. The lighting on here is so cool. What the heck? I want to get this towards. Oh my god. <laughs> Freaking. It's fine. Dude, if you're moving uh, empty. We uh, might. Okay, Blaine, we actually might want to go south a little bit. This thing's bowing out really down there. I don't know. Let's get out ahead of it, though, and see. But, uh, here. I don't. Yeah, you guys can see that. All right. Uh, let me turn on my location. That would be helpful. We are right there, the blue thing. And I think that south part is actually going to be the most pretty. If you look over here, you can see a little shelf cloud forming. 
So here's that look at that shelf cloud thing that I was talking about. Um, it's kind of a shelf. Anyway, I don't know what it is. 100% yet. Locked in. It looked like it was rotating over Kakalan a minute ago, but we're too far from that anyway. Possibly. John! JT Guitar! Hello. Um, big time shelf-ish thingy. Rain's selfish. Rain is coming! Hey guys, uh, just to show you how powerful, because we're on our way back now, look at these rain curtains just to see how powerful they truly are, or like how, I guess, um, compact it is. This is more of a mist here now, but it was like a just big drop. I don't know attack earlier. But yeah, it's just like a wall of rain, but no wind. <laughs> 